Welcome to Chalk Talk, presented by Option Central, the premier source for all things option football, with your host, Coach Tony DeMeo. Now sit back and get your pencil and paper ready for another Play of the Day Chalk Talk from Option Central. Hi, this is Tony DeMeo, and today we're going to work on a little bit of a drop back game and a little bit of a quick game. What we did with our drop back game is we offered the combination of the quick game to one side and the deeper drop to the other side. So to one side, it's catch, step, and throw, that tempo, or catch, step, look, and throw. To the other side, it's one, two, three, throw it, one, two, three, look, and throw it. So in this case, we're going to be in a slot formation, and we're going to have the quick game slice corner route to the boundary, and to the field, we're going to have our stretch route with the uh, stretch and then in and the uh, tailback flare. The quarterback is going to look first to the uh, quick game side and versa blitz, or even if he just likes the quick game side, he'll throw it. If he doesn't like it, he'll drop back two more steps and throw to the stretch side or the other side. So let's look at this and uh, we'll drop the plays and let you see the quarterbacks read on it. Okay, so let's look at this, and here's the way it's going to work. To the this is actually slot left. To the slot to the uh, wide side, the number one receiver is going to do his 14 yard in route. Okay, the number two receiver is going to do the stretch route. Okay, the tailback will check release and then do his flare. Okay, now back here, so that's the drop back side. Back here is the quick game side. So the slot is gonna go down six and he's gonna run a corner route. The slice is gonna take an outside release and he's gonna come in here in the, in the no cover zone and run his slice route. The line is gonna pass protect and versus any blitz, if, the, if any of these backers blitz, the quarterback is going to obviously throw to the quick side. Uh, to the other side, we, the tailback will check release before he releases on his flare. So this is really six-man protection. Okay, now the defense is in a four-shell, even though the safety is a little bit tight, but it's a four-shell with two linebackers inside and this other outside linebacker out here, right there, he's removed. So there's only, we can use six man protection and pretty much know that we can pick up any blitz from these linebackers. Because we have the five offensive linemen and the tailback on a check release to block six. But the quarterback's first read is still going to be to this side right here. And if he likes it, he'll take it and we'll pick up a, a first down. Let's go to the video now and watch this play as it progresses and see the quarterback's reads. Okay, so here's the play unfolding. And you see the slice open and he throws it to him and we have a good game. Okay, now watch it, watch it unfold. You see the protection is going to kick to the, to the uh, boundary. And he sees the slice open and hits it for a nice game. Because what he's going to do is take the high percentage throw. Okay, let's, uh, let's go back and look at it straight through. And you'll see it again. Okay, so here we go. So you see the safety's dropping deep. Now, he throws the ball, catch, step, and throw. If, uh, you know, I, he really had time to go to the other side, but he got rid of the ball, and we got a good gain. And as I said, the, the when in doubt, get rid of the ball and take the positive gain. So that's what we did. Again, we were looking for high percentage throws, and that's what he took. 
Uh, so let's look at it from the end zone here right now. But you see good protection. Line does a good job. And there he is, just he hits that slice. Because again, he puts the ball where the receiver is between the ball and the defender. And we pick up a big game. Let's go to the diagrams right now and, and draw it up for you. Now, in this case, we're, instead of using seven-man protection, we're going to use six-man, but the assignments stay the same. So right here, the, the play side tackle is going to have man-on-man, uh, -man, which would be his defensive end. Play side guard has man-on-man, -man, which is a three technique. These two have these two, and he has the, the end man on the line of scrimmage. Now, normally... This slot would be responsible for, for Will. So in, in, the, in the drawing, Will was actually in here, and he would block Will if he came. But this is six-man protection. And instead, he's going to release and run a corner route, six-yard corner route. The slice is going to come inside here, take an outside release, and then release no deeper than three yards or in the no cover zone. So as, as soon as Will gets any depth at all, he's open. The only time he wouldn't be is if the corner trailed and it was some kind of man-to-man, -man, and then we'd go to the corner route. But the slice is his first read. The corner route is his second. Okay. Now, the quarterback is going to always look to this side first because if it's a blitz with, with somebody coming, he's got to get rid of the ball because that's going to be an unblocked guy. But if, if there's no blitz and, he, and it, now he can go to the other side and he'll reach stretch first to in route second and then flare third, okay? Now, if he still doesn't like everything, he just runs quarterback draw. So that's the way it works. Now, in this particular film, in this case, he likes the slice, and that's his first throw. So if, if he likes it, catch, step, and throw. If he doesn't like it, he can go back two more steps, and read the front side. So let's go back and look at that video again, and you'll see how he likes the slice because the receiver's between the ball and the fender, and he gives it to him for a nice game. Okay, so this is the exact same play. It's slot left, stretch to the field, and slice corner to the boundary. The offensive line has the down, four down linemen and Mike. The backs have uh, Will and, and Sam, and the receivers release. But down here, it's going to be the six-man protection. So he's going to have a free release, and he's going to run his corner out, and this receiver is going to come shallow and run his slice route to the field the, the tailback's going to check and he'll run his flare the number one receiver is going to go down and do his in route and the number two receiver is going to go down and do the stretch route okay and the quarterback if he doesn't like this side this is his first look here then he's going to go to this side to the drop back side for a second look. And in this particular case, you're gonna see him throw the stretch route in there 
on a nice throw, big gain, and a big play in a very high-scoring game. Okay, so let's look at the video now of this, and we'll see how the, the other side works. Because you saw the quick game side, now you're going to see the drop back side. Okay, so here's it's a four shell. The quarterback drops back. There's the stretch route, and he hits it right in the hole for a big game. Let's watch it from the end zone. Good protection. Tailback flares, and there's the stretch route, catching it right inside of the free safety. Let's go back and look at it one more time, a little bit slower, and uh, we'll see it unfold. In this uh, clip, I want you a few things I want you to look at. Number one is the, the defense is going to wind up in a two shell, in a two deep uh, out of a four shell. So they're going to roll that boundary corner up, which will eliminate the in route. So that widest receiver is going to wind up doing a, a fade. The stretch route is the one that we're going to hit. We're going to have the slice corner to the boundary but the quarterback goes downfield with, with his throw. And it's a good thing because actually this is late in the game and we're coming from behind to pick up the win. So let's look at it right now and see this thing develop as we go. You see them moving into their too deep look, the two safeties backing up, the corners trying to play catch technique, and there's the open hole that the quarterback hits the stretch route in. Really nice throw, big gain, and we're in business going down the field. Here's the end zone shot. No blitz. They do a little bit of a cross stunt. You see this, the tailback flares and is picked up, but there's the hole, and it's a nice throw, a nice catch, and uh, a big game. Okay, let's look at it in normal speed back so you see the whole thing again. And uh, you'll see how the quick game side and the drop back side work together. You've been watching Chalk Talk, featuring Coach Tony DeMeo. Chalk Talk is a production of Option Central, the premier source for all things option football. Ready to improve your option football coaching skills? It's time to join OptionCentral.net right now. <laughs>